Let's get to it. All right, YouTube, what's going on? It's Mesa Fail back at it with some Destiny. So, uh, long overdue video because I've had this thing for a while, and uh, I actually bought this thing. I bought it for 150 marks. Um, this is the deal breaker, okay? And this is actually the one you could buy from the Crucible Quartermaster. And uh, Quart I just lost my New York accent there, Quartermaster. Uh, the reason why I bought it was I got a dropped version, okay? First thing that tweaked my interest, the sound, okay? I love how they changed all the gun sounds. This is a Hakka, so it sounds really cool. And I like the way it handled, but didn't have some great perks. So I went on over to the Crystal Quartermaster. There it goes again, Quartermaster, okay, Quartermaster. And I really liked the perks in it. I was like, you know, this is probably a good PvP weapon and good PvE weapon. But I'll give you the TLDR version right now. <clears throat> uh, don't use this in PvP, okay? Auto rifles still stink on ice when it comes to PvP, except for the service regime, Soros Regime. That's the only auto rifle I use in PvP, but even then, Man, I'm, I'm still stuck. I can only use pulse rifles in PvP, but this thing is phenomenal in PvE. You know, uh, so much that I've been infusing the hell out of this thing. Got it up to about 300 attack now, and uh, as of tonight, got some more raid weapons that I'm going to infuse into it to get it even higher. So, I like it in PvE, especially because I want a good legendary for my primary spot, so I could finally start using exotics for my secondary and heavy, because I rely way too much on constantly using an exotic in my primary. So this way I could use my Telesto the Molesto as more than after kill call calls it calls it what's wrong with my accent tonight am i not new yorker now uh and also let's see what else black spindle and so forth so anyway let's go in and take a look at the perks uh that you could actually buy so i well, no from the one you can buy so uh out of the categories of auto rifles it's the one with the uh kind of lower rate of fire but a uh, high impact just like the uh anti poddle hindsight Am I pronouncing that right? Uh, both of these pretty much have the same type of, well, same archetype, right? Is that the word you guys are using? Anyway, let's go into the perks. It's like a Vanquisher, basically, in terms of its rate of fire and impact. But you can see mine's set up for 20 rounds. Uh, it comes with 26 if you don't use the perk Brace Frame. But it comes with Crowd Control, which I think is an excellent PvE perk. And it's got Glass Set Full, another excellent PvE perk. And then down the middle, I always go with Brace Frame because if you don't use Brace Frame, stability is, as you can see right there, you got Snapshot and you got Speed Reload. I will say this, the reload stinks on a, why do I always say stinks, I'm, sorry, I'm in Babel mode tonight, uh, the reload is very slow in this thing, okay, so, but I'm slowly building up my arsenal of gauntlets to help with that reload, uh, prior to the Taken King, I was so spoiled, uh, I had gauntlets for everything, uh, reload, on each character too, reload for scout rifles, reload for hand cannons, reload for pulse rifles, yada yada, so, that's it guys, so I would definitely pick this thing up if you're interested in auto rifles, if you want something that's a little more impact, um, I really haven't looked around, I just, I, I got it and I bought it and I loved it. Um, I'm, I don't know if I really like the focus fire type of auto rifle so much anymore. Um, and sir, when I use my service regime, I find myself using the spinning up a lot more than I do the actual focus fire. Oh, and here's me just go the glitch in to go kill the um, the Ultra Knight so I can see if I can get an exotic Engram. I don't think I do in this one though. Anyway, guys, Babel Mode to Gate. So let me know what you guys think. I would pick this up if you're looking for a legendary auto rifle that's a little more in the impact department. Try it in PvP. I mean, maybe you're better than me. Obviously, I'm bad names McGillicuddy, so not very good at getting headshots, but definitely check it out uh, if you're into auto rifles and want to free up uh, an exotic slot to use for your special or your heavy. So, that guys, drop a like in this video only if you see fit. Follow me on the Twitter at MaceTron. Check out my stream, which is always on YouTube. And that's it. I'm out of here like Vladimir. I'll send Cade an update.